This picture you are seeing now is a diabetic foot ulcer, one of the complications of uh, diabetes. So let's go now to discuss about natural ways to prevent diabetes. Okay, the video you just watched now is a clip of a diabetic foot ulcer. It's one of the complications, one of the things that uh, diabetes can cause. So today, I welcome you once again on this my channel, Chidebere Eze. So if you are a returning viewer, I want to thank you so much for coming on this channel. If this is the first time you see my video, thank you so much for following. And then on this channel, as I told us before, I'll be discussing about health, importance of exercising, and other related matters. So today we have an important topic to discuss. The natural ways. The natural ways to preventing or curing diabetes. diabetes. Now, what is the essence of this video? Some people are at risk of uh, developing diabetes, especially those that have a family history of uh, diabetes. If your mom or your dad or any of your relative has had a uh, diabetes or is having diabetes, just know that you are at risk of developing diabetes. So this video is for you. This video is actually for you so that you can know how to prevent yourself from developing diabetes and also know how to help your system so that you can cure it because they say that prevention is better than cure so when I mean when I use that word cure in this video I mean to prevent or to treat that's what I mean so let's go down to the video proper and talk about the tips or the points that and uh, things you have to do to prevent or to cure diabetes let's hit the point so what are the points now I listed about 12 points 12 tips the natural ways of preventing or treating diabetes number one point is to lose weight lose weight you must lose your weight is a must if you want to prevent diabetes so if your fats or your bees your your weight is so much you have checked your weight and it's so high and your body mass index is high above 30 body mass index is above 30 you are this video is for you so you have to reduce your weight so you have to find a video on exercising which i've made already because exercising especially aerobic exercising is one of the ways one of the things can help you to reduce your weight so that is number one so i made about seven um, 12 points 12 powerful points 12 powerful points to prevent um, diabetes naturally one is to lose weight number two is to be more physically active more physically active so this um, point is like trying to involve you or engage you in exercising it's just like the first point to lose weight in the first one there are many things you can do to lose weight either by your dieting and different things the second one is to be more physically active to be more physically active not be sit down the look because sit down the look can be a risk can be a risk what are the other things? You eat healthy. Eat healthy. Eat healthy plant food. Plant food, they are good. Plant meal are good. Vegetable, your fruits, your legumes, these are things that are made for man that will help you naturally to prevent diabetes, especially when you are at the risk of having it, especially when your family member has had it or is having it, you understand? These are things you can do to help yourself. What are the other things? Then you eat, eat healthy fat. Healthy fat, healthy fat. These are plant containing food as well. Plant containing oil. They are healthy. They are usually healthy. They are usually healthy. These are proven, scientifically proven points, powerful points that I'm giving you that will help you to prevent you from having Developing diabetes. These are points I'm giving you. Solid points that will help you to prevent diabetes. So if you have watched this video, send it across. Share it to your neighbors. Share it to your friends. Share it on your WhatsApp. Share it on your Facebook account. Like this video. If you have not subscribed to my channel, subscribe. Subscribe. I'm still using the opportunity to thank my subscribers and my returning viewers. If your second time, your time of seeing my video. Thank you so much. If this first time, I appreciate. I appreciate. I um, promise you that I will make you proud. 
or make us proud. So what are the other things you can do to prevent you from having a diabetes? Quit smoking. If we chase smoker, quit smoking. Because smoking has been found to be one of the risk factors, major risk factors of developing diabetes. How it causes it cannot be contained in this video. It can be contained in the video. But what I'm trying to tell you is that you must avoid it if you want to live a healthy life. Then cut sugar or refined carbohydrates. Refined carbohydrates. All those processed food, processed food, your noodles and stuff. Avoid or reduce, cut them. Reduce the quantity you are taking. Reduce how frequently you take them. These are points. Points. So these are about this, the six points I'm making. So how about, about the remaining six points? So if you want to prevent yourself from having it, if you are one of your family member has had it, this is point. What are the seven points? Seven points is drink plenty of water. Water, water, and water, and water again. Water is very, very important. As an adult, you're supposed to take about three liters of water in a day. In a 24 hour, you have to take about three liters of water. That is about uh, five sachets of, uh, of, of water. Because a sachet of water contains about 60 cl, about 60 or 600 mils of water. So you have to take enough water in a day. That will help you to prevent that. And of course, you have to watch what you eat. The portion of what you eat. You don't need to take plenty and plenty and plenty of, of food. You get portion. Minimize it. Morning meal, afternoon meal. What I would advise is that take your normal morning meal or small morning meal. In the afternoon, eat as much as you want to eat. Then in the, in the night, take small quantity. This is a way of rationing or helping to prevent you from developing um, the chronic disease, which is diabetes, which is very, very terrible. Avoid sedentary lifestyle. This is the ninth point. Avoid sedentary lifestyle. Some of us, we cannot trek. Going to church, we use bike or use our vehicle. To walk one kilometer, we step panting. You understand? Sedentary lifestyle is one of the factors. It has been confirmed and be found as one of the risk factors in developing chronic diseases like diabetes, like uh, hypertension. So avoid sedentary lifestyle. Sometimes take a walk to, to your work, to your office. Take a walk. Walk for one kilometer. It's not bad, it's not key. Walk to office. It's not every time you go to the market, you use bike, you use keke. No. Sometimes take a walk. You'll not die by doing, the, by doing those things. Instead, you live healthier and happier. Then minimize your intake of proce processed food. I have said this thing before. It's like a repetition of one of the one of the points above, but they are not exactly the same thing. Minimize the intake of processed food. Cook your food if possible. Cook your food. Try to make a chance to cook your own food at home. Eat healthy. Eat healthy. Then what you have to do is that you you take more of a um, vitamin D containing food because it can be found out that you have people that have that have a low Vitamin D, that is vitamin D deficient, they are at higher risk of developing diabetes. That is why you should have, you should eat um, vitamin D containing meals like all those seafoods, your bones, and stuff. These are vitamin D, and sometimes you can take it as a supplement. These are vitamin D containing food, especially the seafoods and your bones. They will help you to live healthy. Now, another point you have to know is that you have to avoid some drugs. Some of us, they will go to hospital, maybe they will prescribe a cortisol containing drugs like prednisolone. Maybe you are having a, something, upper respiratory tax infection, and the doctor, or you are having a chest infection, and the doctor just decided to prescribe a, a cortisol medic medication for you. You don't take it, you're okay. Or you're having pain, or you're having an allergic reaction, and the doctor not prescribe it for you. Now, some of us now go home and start using those drugs on our own without knowing that this, some of these drugs can actually predispose you to having diabetes. Do you understand? So these are the 12 power points, 12 power points that will help you to prevent um, diabetes naturally. 12 power points. You must also avoid alcohol. I don't mean like 
entirely cannot take a call no what i mean by avoid reduce the quantity you're taking that would mean avoid if possible you can stop it it will not kill you but if you must take be moderate in whatever you're doing so these are the points powerful points that will help you to prevent uh, diabetes so i want to thank you so much for listening to this video please i want to thank my uh, subscribers people that have subscribed so far to this uh, youtube channel uh, you are an encouragement to me i want to thank you so much then my viewers thank you people that have liked my videos thank you so much please if you have not subscribed to my channel do subscribe so that anytime i post video videos on uh, health tips and other things you can see it and learn from it and share it to your loved ones thank you so much kindly subscribe to chidebereze share like and do as much as you can to promote this channel and promote our health thank you so much and may god bless you as you do the tips that i've given you today thank you so much